Good morning, everyone. It is Monday, January 3rd, 2022, the first Monday of the new year. Hope everyone had a good weekend. And we're going to get started here with your daily tarot reading for today. Just know it's not going to resonate with everyone, but it will resonate with some. So please take what resonates and leave the rest behind. Okay, let's do it. Universe guides, angels, and spirits, what is the overall energy, please, for my collective today, Monday, January 3rd, 2021. Two cards came out. We have the Four of Cups. And we have the Three of Cups. All right, there's going to be an offer coming in for you guys today. Actually, we'll put these up here. <clears throat> this could be something good, guys. What else? What else is going on with my collective? Thank you. What do we have here? The Page of Swords. The Five of Pentacles. So whatever this offer is, this is all about knowing something to be um, the truth in a situation. I feel like this this offer is it's going to frighten you a little bit because you're worried about um, perhaps um, doing the wrong thing and it not turning out in your favor. Um, I feel like this is a group effort and it's not something just for you specifically. So this could be something related to work, perhaps. The Seven of Swords. Yeah, you, you have a lot of concern about this. You're in your head a lot about this. Or you will be. One more card. If this is a love reading for some of you, someone may be coming back wanting to um, clear the air with you. And I don't know if you're really feeling it. I don't think you're really feeling it. Okay, what do we have here? This is actually turning out to be more of a love reading. We do have the lovers, right? We have the Nine of Swords. And we have the Eight of Wands. So, okay, this is a love reading. Someone did you dirty in the past and they're coming back. They want to talk to you and clear the air, perhaps, you know, uh, sit and spend some, some time together. But this person, either you walked away from them or they walked away from you. And although I feel one of you still watches the other person, I still feel like this is something that I don't feel like you really want to um, go into that again, you know. But they do want to come and talk to you with the Eight of Wands. What else, please? What else? The Page of Pentacles. They do have some type of offer for you. Um, yeah, they, they are longing for you with the Three of Wands. They are so longing for you. All right. Let's get some clarifiers here. Spirit, what can you tell my collective, please, about this reading? What can you tell my collective? Why is the Page of Swords here? Thank you. The Hermit. So they've gone within and they've assess the situation they've probably been watching you whether it's online or from afar and they're realizing now what they've lost and why is the five of pentacles here why is the five of pentacles here the ace of swords in the reverse they weren't thinking clearly. They weren't thinking clearly when this happened. Their mindset is, I wasn't thinking clearly. And they weren't being honest with themselves and with you. 
Why the Seven of Swords? Why the Seven of Swords, please? Thank you. Two of Cups in the reverse. In the reverse. And why the lovers? Gemini energy. The moon. Secrets. This could have been a very emotional ending. But there were secrets between the two of you. And I do feel there is love here. Um, but they, they definitely weren't thinking when they did whatever it was that they did. Now underneath the deck we have the nine of swords. We have it twice here. So, definitely have um, been in their head over this. Why the Three of Wands? You know, they're, they're, they were waiting. Um, they're longing for you, especially underneath the Page of Swords. I feel like they were waiting for the right time. Some of them we're waiting for you to reach out. Yeah, they, they're waiting for that moment where they can let you know that they want to work on this. Page of Pentacles, why is that here? The Knight of Cups. In the reverse. So there's been no movement from this person. I do, though, see that there is love. But the devil. This possibly was a toxic relationship prior to um, the end and then wanting them to come, you know, they wanting them wanting to come back. I can't talk today. Why the eight of wands, please? Now, you know, this is just the daily is supposed to be short and sweet, but I'm trying to get as much info as I can. Eight of wands, please. Thank you. They want to talk to you about some options, right? Th this could confuse you as well. When they come to you, you're going to be like, why are you here now? For what? And why the Nine of Swords? Why the Nine of Swords? Thank you. We have the Knight of Swords rushing in. Rushing in. They they can barely take it anymore. The energy is like I have to I have to get to my collective here. I have to get to them and I need to talk to them now. I need to tell them how I'm feeling. There could have been a third party involved here with this three of cups. But they want to speak their truth to you. They do have an offer, but again, you know, I don't know if you're really gonna be into that offer so much. Let me get you some advice. Spirit, what advice do you have for my collective regarding this? this one. What advice, please? Here's the other. Okay. Be present. Use the hours. Don't count them. Don't waste your time, I feel like this is saying, but that's up to you. You know, that's up to you. Use the hours, but don't count them. Be present. Breathe. Slow down and contemplate the tea. Violets and the ivy tangled around the eaves. So just take a couple of deep breaths. And, you know, use your uh, intuition. You know, that's never going to guide you wrong. So there you go, collective. It was a kind of long one today, but you know what? It started out one way, and look at how it ended up. Um, I love, love, love you guys. Happy Monday to you, and I'll see you later. Take care. Bye.